GTX 750 Ti Strix OC Edition. Okay, I'm just joking. This card does not sing or dance. It's quite an opposite. Strix means it's uh, super silent. Actually, Asus claims uh, zero dB noise because uh, this card is cooled passively. Here's my PC. As you can see, it's uh, running, but uh, fans are not spinning, at least on the uh, GPU card. So I can play a few more rounds of Counter-Strike GO and we will check uh, temperatures again. Still zero RPM, that is interesting, and temperature is uh, just slightly over 40 degrees of Celsius. And this card is OC edition, that means uh, GPU frequency is overclocked and it has extra boost. And as you can see here, if we are always using GPU boost, uh, fans will uh, uh, kick eventually and start spinning uh, almost at idle speeds less than 10%. And another nice thing about this GPU tweak utility that it allows to limit uh, maximum GPU boost or fan speed or in-game FPS. So if we do that, uh, we can always have uh, a passive cooling uh, by trading uh, extra FPS, we don't need uh, in game, for example, I'm playing on 60 Hz monitor, so running game at 200 FPS was uh, not very efficient. On the uh, other hand, even at uh, maximum overclock and boost, uh, this card uh, is ru still running super cool and uh, fans are rarely spinning at idle speeds less than 10%. Another nice thing that uh, this card does not require extra power, so you just put it in your PCI slaughter and you don't need any extra power cables. We have the GTX 660 on my desk, uh, uh, to an overclocked edition, and I tried to compare this older card with a new 750 Ti model. And as you can see, uh, performance is really I can say identical, uh, the difference is less than 10%. Uh, but if, if you listen to my PC, the, the sound difference is, is not 10%, it's not 50%, uh, it's like a vacuum cleaner and completely silent PC, so, so that's the biggest difference. By the way, I'm running all this game at Full HD or Quad HD resolution and maximum graphic settings. So thanks for watching, thumbs up and subscribe for more videos.